shit go crazy. my good folks it's your man your guy your boy 11 27 kicks i hope everybody out there is having a great day an amazing day and overall blessed day say man if you're new to the channel do your boy a huge favor hit that like button go ahead and subscribe to the page and if you're already with the movement bro i greatly appreciate you man hit that like button share this video and let's go ahead and keep this page growing so before we even get it started, you did. You see the hat on my head, bro. Make sure y'all go ahead and shop with Halo Apparel, man. They sell hats, they sell hoodies. You can find them on Instagram at Halo Apparel. You dig, man. The link to their website is in their bio as well. And they, like I said, hats, hoodies, great merchandise, affordable pricing, high quality, fast shipping, all that, man. Give them a follow on Instagram as well. Now, with that being said, this Friday, February 18th, for a retail price of 240 of them boys <laughs> we got the lebron nine big bangs that are dropping man now if you haven't been tapped in with your boy page man i say about a week ago about a week and a half i did do the copper drop video on this shoe man but now you already know we a few days out of release day so it's we it's kind of yeah we're gonna do this little how to cop man is it's really not a lot, you know what I'm saying, that's really going on, bro. But I'm going to feed y'all what I can, man. So sit back, relax, and enjoy the video. So, man, as you can see with this shoe right here, man, you got your LeBron 9. You have your orange on there. Then the other color that you see on there as well, man, it seems like a, you know, I would say like a reddish orange in my personal opinion right there, man. You know, on the Nike swoosh, one thing that is a dope hint on this shoe right here, man, is that the swoosh actually is 3M. So you take a picture with the flash, it will, you know what I'm saying, light up like an Air Jordan 5, you know, tongue on the shoe. You feel me? Then on top of that, the bottom of the shoe actually glows in the dark as well. Another nice touch that I like about that, the inside liner of the shoe, you'll see that Galaxy theme on the inside liner on the shoe. And then on the insoles of the shoe, you will actually see a logo of a lion. And of course, you already know King James. And then on the heel tabs of the shoe, you will see the number nine spelled out. You already know, representing that this is the LeBron 9. Now, like I said before, this shoe was actually, you know, a PE, a player's exclusive. This shoe was not an attainable shoe when it came out in 2012. Back then, you could ask anybody. Players exclusives was literally players exclusive. You had to be plugged in and know somebody to possibly get a pair. And if you seen somebody with some player exclusives, they was probably flugazy just to keep it real with you. So this shoe right here actually coming out is a big thing. You feel me? Especially with where LeBron's at in his career and where these shoes hold when where he was at in his career. You feel me? He was with the Miami Heat. 2012 that 2012 season did they yep that's the season they actually won his first chip in miami that was his first chip that was an mvp a year of his as well man so this shoe this silhouette actually carries a lot of weight just in my personal opinion as far as lebron career goes now with that being said before we even get into where you could buy the shoe we're gonna go ahead and you know hop into this resale real quick and you already know that's what everybody really cares about you dig so as you can see with this shoe on stock x man this shoe was going for some money. Retail price is $240, and you're looking at $330 and up. You feel me? Now, of course, that size 8, if I'm not mistaken, that says like $307, something like that. So it's really not popping too much as far as that goes. You're looking at probably like a $60 profit when it comes to that. But everything else is looking good. That 7, that 7.5 is looking good. And then that 11 on up is actually looking very good as well. I think those big sizes are definitely going to fly big sizes with lebron's always fly first man it's a bulky shoe it's a big guy shoe so with that being said right there man i definitely you know expect these shoes to actually fly off as far as the big sizes go this shoe's going to sell out regardless but big sizes will be going faster than smaller sizes just in my personal opinion same thing as you see on goat man this shoe was going for 300 and up 330 and up now for a lot of it you will see 347 a lot but once you get to that size 11 range on up it's looking really good that size seven and a half on go actually looks well too so once again like i said before bro you know seven seven and a half is always great sizes to get when it comes to getting shoes if you want to resell especially you know seven and men's seven and a half and men's hard sizes to get for retail hard sizes to find just in general so when you do get those sizes man you can really tax what you want 
you dig what I'm saying? You can really tax what you want when it comes to that, You when it comes to those sizes. Then of course, like I said before, the bigger sizes are definitely a go. 11 on up is definitely a huge go right there, bro. So with that being said right there, man, if I was just, you know, trying to go for the shoe, in my personal opinion, as far as resale go, I'm going for every big size I could possibly get you feel me to maximize my profit that's just in my personal opinion now if i could grab a couple sevens a couple seven and a halves i will but personally if i'm just looking to resale i'm definitely going for the bigger sizes 11 on up that's all i'm shooting for but if you get any pair man you're looking at a pretty good profit when it comes to this shoe at least a hundred dollars at the very least now with that being said right there with this shoe and shout out to my man's jj all day you have to go at least to a half a size to a full size up on LeBron nines, man, you feel me? If you don't, if you go true to size, it's gonna fit snug. Just how like people were saying about the LeBron South Beaches that actually dropped last year. If you got your true to size, it was probably a half a size or a size too small. So you have to actually, you know, go up a little bit, you feel me? So don't be one of those people, you know what I'm saying, on release date and stuff like that. And you going for your true to size, man, you're gonna be highly disappointed. But if you wear a size 12, you're really getting yourself a size 11, 11 and a half at the most. So I definitely say if you're a size 12 like me or something, go for that 12 and a half, go for that 13. The shoe is going to fit perfect on your feet. You feel me? Now, with that being said right there, as far as where you can buy the shoe, this shoe is a sneakers app exclusive. This shoe is only releasing via sneakers. I have looked around. Maybe this shoe is going to release in like tier zero stores or something like that. But right now, this is looking like a very limited release. This shoe is releasing on a Friday. Those middle of the week, those shoes that drop Monday through Friday. You feel me? Except for these dark marina blues that are dropping on Wednesday. But usually, shoes that drop during the week, man, they're really not a lot of them. But this shoe right here definitely makes sense. This shoe is actually coming out on Friday. Now, one thing about shoes that come out on Friday, those babies are limited. For real, for real. So... This is actually joining the party right here, and I'm really not surprised about it, man. So, hey, man, right here, this is just the luck of the draw right here. Just to keep it honest with you, just to keep it funky with everybody. This is the only, this is the only chance you got as of right now. Maybe Foot Locker and other places might get them. It's going to be All-Star Weekend, so I wouldn't be surprised if Tier Zero stores in Cleveland and stuff like that get these big bangs. But other than that, man, Sneakers app is where you're going to have to get this shoe, bro. You feel me? Now, with that being said right there, like I always say, uh, for one, update your sizes right now, like I said before, because if you don't update your sizes, it's a possible chance if you try to do it the day of, that it might not register in Nike system and they'll send you, you know, your original size that you've been having on the app. So you want to update your sizes right now so it won't be any issues. If you're using multiple devices, don't be on the same Wi-Fi on all the devices because the IP address will show up and Nike will cancel your order because they'll think it's a bot. And then the last thing I'll honestly say, they the shipping that they use, Lays or whatever, is a horrible shipping company. You feel me? So make sure y'all tap in with them. If you dig, if that's the one that they're using, I forgot the name of it. I was talking to my man's technology the other day, but that shipping company is not good at all. Now, hopefully, you know, some people get FedEx or UPS and you'll be straight. But if you get that laser, whatever, you need to tap in and track your package immediately, immediately, because these folks is not playing around. They, they taking packages, bro, for real, for real, man. New shipping company, they ain't got it all together yet. So make sure y'all tap in with that. But other than that, there you have it with the shoe. Like I said, this is a dope shoe. This is definitely a cop in my opinion. I definitely see myself getting this shoe down the line right now. I'm holding my coins personally because it's it's something that I'm looking at right now. And you feel me? I just gotta I gotta hold this right now because it's it's I got something covered very, very soon, man. So with that being said, let me know how y'all feel about this video, man. Let me know if this video is informational for y'all. Will y'all be going for the LeBron 9 Big Bangs? Are y'all just good on them? Let me know how y'all feel. And I just want to say I greatly appreciate y'all, man. Y'all stay blessed. Y'all stay safe. Y'all already know how we finna end the video off. If you search for good, you shall find a favor. If you search for evil, you shall find you. Proverbs 11, 27. And we walk in faith and not by sight. For what is seen is temporary, what is unseen is forever. I live by that. I stand by that, man. Y'all stay blessed. Y'all stay safe. And it's your boy, 1127 Kicks. And always remember, bless your feet with something. Who did hit me up and told me shit on these niggas? Tell these niggas I had came back to go on showing the different. Keep on dropping all of that shit that made you for wanna listen. You know these niggas ain't fucking tellin' get out of here.